one I wanted to take today to talk about online gaming and its general growth in social media, consoles, uh, not so much with PC gaming but a lot with tablets now and mobile devices. And really I wanted to touch on how much time it really consumes in one's life and I definitely don't think that's a good thing. I really think that a lot of people spend a little bit too much time with online gaming. I think that just a fraction of that you know, could be used uh, for a fraction of someone's time could be used towards gaming and then the remainder should really be going towards other things that are more important in their life, things that would lead to further growth, either personal growth, business growth, whatever it may be, you know, that time you're not getting back, you're, you're leveling character, you're, you're, you know, acquiring gold, or you're doing whatever you're doing and that's it, once the game goes off, that's all, you know, that's, that's all you got, you're not taking anything with you there. So, I really think that a lot of people do spend too much time with online gaming. So, what I would recommend doing, at least for starters, is just trying to monitor how much time is really going into your gaming. If you, if you find you're doing quite a bit of it, then really try to keep track of that and see if you can try to break it up a little bit and allocate time elsewhere in things that are a little bit more productive, uh, things that are a little bit more important and things that really just are really for longevity, things that you have going forward that aren't going to be gone the second you turn off that device or turn off that PC, whatever it may be. You know, don't level your character, level yourself, you know, level yourself in life, progress, grow, and can you continue to do so. Uh, I, I'm mentioning this because I, I'm actually somewhat of a gamer. I used to be a, an avid gamer. I used to play all the time, you know, in my early teens. I can't really do so now. There's just too much going on. I'm just too busy. I still do like to find a little bit of time, again, in moderation, to to play a couple games here or there. In fact, uh, Battlefield 4 is coming out. I'll be definitely picking that up. I'm a huge Battlefield fan, and I always have been. What you're not going to find me doing is sitting there and playing it 5, 10, 15 hours a day. It's just not going to happen. I'll play now and then with some friends, and that'll really be the extent of it. Uh, and uh, As a form of a stress relief, or just as a form of relax relaxation, just to sit there and you know shut off your brain. I mean, with Battlefield, you're not going to shut off your brain, but you can, you know, you get the idea. So I just wanted to touch on that, and uh, I just, wanted to actually ask, what games do you play? Do you do any social media gaming, any online gaming at all, or you know, what, what, what are you doing with your time? So share that with me, let me know. I wouldn't mind checking out some other games too. I mean, I'm always interested in at least having a look. I, I know that a lot of people are involved in the social networking games. I mean, Angry Birds blew up for that reason. You got other ones like Mafia Wars and Farmville, and the, I mean, the list goes on and on. So I'd like to know what you're playing, and I'd like to know how much time you're spending on your gaming. Because it, you know, if, if you find it's too much, you may want to revisit that and try to think of how you can allocate your time elsewhere. But other than that, that's all I wanted to talk about today, and have a great Monday.